I have a Sky device here, Elite 6.0. As you can see, there's currently a pin code lock on here. If you guys have an issue or something similar, I'll be showing you guys how to remove it. As you can see, uh, with this pin code, uh, without it, you won't be able to log in. Um, if you're one of the lucky ones to have put one on and forgot about it, uh, it just usually happens after you left the device alone for a while and just try to use it at one point in time and just can't remember. Now, um, it could also be a pattern. It could also be a phrase. Um, Any who would still get the the job done um, using the same method. Um, now, before we begin, I want I want to advise you guys out there who's watching um, to get this completely removed. You would uh, have to wipe your phone completely. Now, to, when I mean wipe, it's gonna delete everything off off this uh, device, also known as a hard reset or a factory reset, whichever you guys prefer to use. Now, um, if you have a Google account associated with this phone, uh, whenever you reset it and set, set uh, whenever you set it up again, it's gonna ask for an uh, email account. Um, if you had that email account backed up too. Um, just input your email account and your password and everything should begin downloading. Shouldn't take that long, give or take 15 minutes if you barely have anything on your, your phone. But if you have like pictures, videos, not necessarily videos, but uh, apps, it could take a while for that to, to fully download. Um, so I just want to go ahead and advise you guys, it can take up to 30 minutes, maybe 45 minutes just for that to download, depending on your connection. Um, but if you don't have anything backed up, um, it's going to delete everything, all your information, and there's kind of no way around this. Um, if you just want to leave it alone and just re uh, try to remember the password, I would recommend that. But if you just want to go ahead and just wipe it and get get started to using the phone, uh, then then I guess this is the option on for you. What you got to do first is power off the device. Once it's powered off, give it or give it two seconds. Once it's powered off, you will hold volume up and power at the same time. Now these Sky devices have the recovery menu a little bit different. And there we go. When I say different, this black screen comes up. Now as you can, if you can try, let me try to focus the words. It's not focusing. But anywho, I'll just read it to you. It says volume up to, to select and volume down to OK. So what, what it's saying is um, to navigate the uh, the arrow, this is the arrow, this is where where we're at. And right now, if we want to get to recovery, just simply hold down once this arrow is on recovery. It's not, if it's not on recovery, um, press up to get to recovery, just in case you pressed it while uh, loading but as you can see if you push up it goes to fast boot if you push up again it goes to normal normal we'll just reboot it um, but since we're trying to get to recovery mode we'll push up again and once we're at on, on the recovery side you will then press volume down to confirm and once it's confirmed there we go you can see a little bit better um, and now you would hit power just to make that disappear once you hit power, you will come down to where it says wipe data factory reset. And then hit the power button. This time you're going to hit the power button to confirm. Now, once you hit the power button, you should take you to the screen. And you would uh, navigate using volume down to go down and volume up to go up. Now, just go all the way down to where it says yes, delete all user data. Um, once you're on there, or once it's highlighted, hit power again to confirm. And once it's confirmed, the phone should now be resetting. As you can see on the bottom, it says wipe, and all and whatnot. It says da data wipe complete. Now, once it's complete, where it says re reboot system, now it's already highlighted. I'm just trying to read it to you guys since it's not focusing since it's highlighted. As you can see, reboot system now. Make sure it's on there and then hit power again to reboot the system. Rebooting is just restarting the phone. Uh, once it's rebooting, it should uh, 
take a couple of minutes just to configure and whatnot. Um, it's just preparing your phone, downloading the basic uh, apps that come included. And it's just reinstalling all the, the necessa necessary settings and configuration. Um, like I said, it only takes five minutes to get there. It could take less. Um, but once once you confirm everything, just uh, simply set set up your uh, device, uh, select your language, com connect to Wi-Fi if you have Wi-Fi, um, add your Google account if you have a Google account if you don't create one, and just by that you should get to the menu. Now if you found this video helpful, don't forget to like and subscribe to help my, my base out to, so that way I can keep adding more videos. So thanks for watching.